Guys, today is the happiest I've ever been because Maine has made cannibalism legal and not just cannibalism, but you can just cannibalize anybody you feel like as long as you go by the amendment that they passed. So here's the wording of the amendment exactly as it comes from. Directly from Maine, the government of Maine. All individuals have a natural, inherent, and unalienable right to save and exchange seeds and the right to grow, raise, harvest, produce, and consume the food of their own choosing for their own nourishment, sustenance, bodily health, and well-being. As long as the individual does not commit, here's the crimes, pay attention to the crimes, because this is why cannibalism is legal. As long as you do not commit trespassing, theft, poaching, or other abuses of private property rights, public lands, or natural resources in the harvesting, production, or acquisition of food. So, you want to cannibalize somebody, and they don't want you to cannibalize them. That's That would be murder, right? Mm-mm. Or assault, if maybe you just take a slice off of them right, right, right here. This piece right here. You take a piece off of here. Eat it. That'd be assault. And that would be illegal, right? Not in Maine. Is it trespassing to take this off of me? No, as long as you do not break into my house and slice this off of me. That's not trespassing. Theft. If you just take this part off of here, this is part of me. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a person. I'm not property. You can't steal me. If you abduct me, that's not theft. If you were to abduct me while I'm wearing clothes or my glasses, then you're stealing my clothes and my glasses. And so th then you couldn't do that. Poaching? I might be big like an elephant, but I ain't, you, can't, you can't poach me. Poaching doesn't apply to humans. And then the abuses of private property rights, public lands, or natural resources. Well, I'm not property. I'm not a public land. And I sure as hell am not a natural resource. So if you were to come up to me and just take a knife, in Maine, by the way, and just go right, right here, take this off of me and eat it, I can't do anything. It's legal to do that. But let's say you want to eat an entire person. You can still do it. Here's what I would do. Go out into the woods with the person you want to eat. You're going to have to convince them to go out there. Uh, to come up with some reason. And when you get out there, say, man, oh man, oh man. It sure is hot out today. Just take off all of your clothes. So first off, make sure they don't want to eat you. Because once your clothes are off, they can legally eat you. And then you go, go say, hey, so hot out here. Let's just, let's just be free. Let's just be free of all the all this warm clothing and they'll take their clothes off make sure they take their glasses off if they're wearing them make sure they're not wearing any contact lenses make sure they're not wearing rings uh, watches bracelets or anything in their hair make sure there's no pins because remember you cannot commit theft when you cannibalize somebody that's illegal once they are completely nude you can legally eat them and they do not have to consent to it because there is nothing in this amendment that requires consent of the food that you are eating. On an unrelated note, I'm going to Maine uh, for this great hunting trip. So if you guys want to come along, uh, just leave a comment below. Uh, just uh, uh, just leave the GPS coordinates of where in the woods you're going to be. And make sure you're just completely nude because I'm uh, hunting very scared animals that do not like any fibers. Uh, they'll, they'll run away when they smell it. And uh, if you could, like, uh, start up a fire, maybe put a grill over it, that'd be fantastic. Thanks.